Well, only about a 45 minute or so paddle, beautiful paddle this morning from the campsite uh, at Smirch Lake. Uh, further up, I think Turtle Creek I'm back on now, and you come to these rapids, and so just to the left of the rapids, no wind through, through that creek, and it was beautiful, kind of shallow water, so you could see uh, the rocks and the bottom and everything. Water's getting a little more clear now. It's a little chilly still, but uh, now that I've got the blood going a bit from canoeing, and I'm sure the portage will warm me up. Well, I'm nearing the north end of where Turtle Creek meets Dimple Lake, which I believe is, or Dimple or Dibble, one of the two. And there's uh, some falls around there. And I came across this little, nice little spot for lunch. Well, the uh, Dibble Lake Portage kind of messed me up a bit. It is here, which is way, you can see way off to the distance there, just past that big rock are the falls. Um, so it's way off to the left of the falls. And if uh, along the way your sleeping bag and uh, mat and tent got wet, there is a lush one bedroom apartment here that you can use. Here is campsite for the second night. Uh, it's on a beautiful lake. I don't actually think it's named, but uh, holy smokes, it's just glass calm. Uh, the water is like this beautiful emerald green color, very clear. Uh, wish there was some sun. I always want the sun to come out, but that's all right. From the lake just past Turtle Creek, you go into this unnamed lake in camp. That's where I was last night. It's a really nice paddle through to this portage. And you're walking up the rapids on the sides. You can kind of hear the water rushing over this way. But man, three days in, my shoulders are starting to feel it. My back is sore. I definitely don't want to carry that canoe five or 600 meters, but uh, Gotta do it. Um, this is definitely White Otter Lake that we're on right now. We just came through the narrows and we're opening up into the main part of the lake. I think there's a campsite somewhere on this, the back of this island here. And uh, there should be a campsite just north, like I, to the left of uh, where I think White Otter Castle might be there. Just rounded the corner out onto where White Otter Lake opens up. Um, there's this beautiful beach right here and uh, it looks like there's two campsites on the beach this one i haven't checked out the other one yet but this one is like unreal we have a literal kitchen with counters and shelves and stuff and then we have a table with chairs i'm gonna definitely stop here for a bite to eat and uh stretch my legs out maybe even do a quick workout so then i'll finish up lunch here and then i'll head over to white otter castle 